10 boards, a nightmare or just another exam. But the big question today, is NCRT enough to score 90 plus in CBC board exams or do you need any extra books, guidebooks and coaching notes? Let's clear the confusion once and for all. As we said in our earlier video, NCRT is not just another textbook. It's the foundation of your syllabus. Every CBC board exam papers are strictly based on this textbook. So, ignoring NCRT, bad idea. But does that mean you can rely only on NCRT? Well, not so fast. Here's the truth. NCRT covers all the basics, but CBC has evolved. In recent years, board exams have seen a rise in application-based case study and hot, aka high order thinking skills question. This is where many students panic. You read NCRT, you understood the concepts, but suddenly there is a question that doesn't have direct answer in the book. What do you do? See, NCRT is essential, but treating it as a only resource is risky. The best approach, use it as your core and build on it by practicing extra questions from sample papers and previous year questions. Think of NCRT as your main toolkit, but sharpen your skills with additional practice. That's how toppers do it. So, is NCRT enough? Yes, for concept clarity. No, if you want to be fully prepared, what's your take? Do you rely on NCRT or use extra resources? Drop a comment below. For more such interesting videos, subscribe our channel and click the bell icon.